Welcome back, Wild, it's Sleepwalk Stalker bringing you guys another episode of Dong and Ro Oh, wait, uh, no, we're playing Pokemon Sword. Last episode, we beat up some Team Yow goons again. I don't know why they keep coming back. And we got an upgrade to our bike. Uh, wait, no, go back. Anyway, this episode, we're gonna make our way back, I guess. And clear some stuff up we haven't done yet. Well, not really, I'm only going to do one thing, which is... Going back to... Hammerlock, because... Hammerlock is where all the cool kids hang out. I'm not, I'm not jealous, I swear. It's clearly not Stone Side. Stone Side's the best place. I'm going to defend that for the rest of my life. Ooh, sh shiny item. Okay, never mind, we're going to intrude... We're going to commit a g giant robbery. Okay. I have a feeling that the, the reason you said something about flying taxis, you probably own all the flying taxis and you're lying to us. Oh, you're dying here, not bad. I'm never going to use it, but still. If it was Pokemon Masters, however, different story. Okay. You're not the girl. Are you the girl? Hello! Hello there. You look like someone I might trust. You see, there's something I there's someone I fancy, and uh, I I've written him a love letter. Do you think you might deliver it for me? I mean, I guess you can't leave the city. I'll do it for you. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'm so glad I found someone like you to help me. My name's Paula. Here you are. This is the letter I want you to deliver. So this isn't any new letter, it's... Deliver it to Frank for me, won't you? Frank and... Balonlia. All on Leah. Yeah, Leah's throwing a party every day. That's who you want. There you go. Off to Fairyland we go. We can actually skip travel now. Don't know if I mentioned that. Are you Frank? Frank? That's my grand granddad's name. What? What do you what are you on about? Are you Frank? Okay, never mind. You must be Frank. Okay, you be creepy over there. Well, she's a granddad, so you you're looking for Frank? Yeah, that'd be me. What's this? You got a letter addressed to me? You sure, mate? Yeah, we just handed this little girl's sweet little, sweet little letter to this random old man that we found in a kingdom of mushrooms. Now, who could be sending me letters? Oh, why? It's from. It says it's from Paula. Ah, that does take me back ages. Paula was the name of the girl I spent all my time playing with when I was a young lad. She fell ill. Didn't tell me though. She kept it a secret just how sick she was. We ended up having a row about it, then I moved away not long after that fight. I never met her again after that day I left. How was she? Did she look well? Dear old Paula. Uh, I think Paula's dead, mate. <laughs> What quiet type are you? Me, I've got your tongue. I reckon I want to give you something for this gift you bought. For you've bought me back a piece of my youth. Wow, you've given me one of the best items in the game. The choice scarf. I just want to get it because uh, eventually I'm going to need to get that. Let's head off, I guess, to. Where are we? Where do we need to go? Yep, I learned how to say this. It's not Churchester, it's Sir Chester. Anyway, pretty sure I said something even worse. I don't remember. It's been a long time since I've come back to recording. Although, my actual Let's Play literally started in a couple... It literally starts in a couple of days. It's not July 17th yet. Anyway... Uh, 
I'm just gonna walk past or something. Sometimes this snom here can be shiny. Just gonna save it now. I've seen it be shiny. Which I find kind of weird, but it's fine. Okay, thanks mechanic, Dr. Guy, the third. I'm going to be on my merry way. Actually, let's switch up our team. Probably should have healed. That's fine. Well, let's, let's swap cyanide out to the front. That'll be helpful, I guess. Now let's make our way through this area. Oh, that reminds me, there's a, pretty sure there's a TM down hit this way, I'm gonna go get that first. This isn't a TM, but... Completely just avoid that trainer, because why not? And go up the secret path down there where there's a lady for some reason. And TM64 have a launch. No, I thought it'd be TM Wing Cap. Okay, it's fine. Oh, now you spot me, do you? Okay, I just realised we could have completely avoided that fight because I need to skip travel to Turfield because who would have thought we would come back here ever again? Oh no, that's not it. No, oh, you know where that is it? Where am I going? Okay. Now that I understand geography slightly better about a virtual world. It's fine. I should have healed. I'll do it later. I'm gonna go this way. Now, Cordon should be. Uh, yeah, Cordon did appear. And there's a TM down here. Solar Beam. Quite nice. So, this place does have a tiny bit more to it than actually meets the eye. Anyway, I'm gonna head back and heal. Okay, back on Route 9. We're here, I guess. Nothing really changed. I healed up. Didn't buy anything new. We got two new TMs. We ran into a Whalmer. And I'm acting like we're about to end off the episode, even though it's been like seven minutes. But no, there's still tons left to do this episode. I should have probably killed that for experience, but it's fine. Plenty of other things. That that Pokemon over there looks like an octopus. Should really be a water type, but it isn't. Why are you jumping onto land? I don't even know how that sea creatures get beached and die. And I just remembered that dead whales explode. Yeah, that's an actual fact. Dead whales explode. I'm pretty sure I can't run away from you, so I'm going to have to fight you, and you're level 50. What do I want to do? Nuzzle. What? You didn't get paralyzed? But why? Why didn't you get paralyzed? You should have been paralyzed. Do you have an ability I'm not aware about? Fine, toxic. And 
any toxic poison. Yeah, would it, would it be better if I just catch you? Would that that'd be quicker, wouldn't it? What do I have? Uh, you know, what? I'll just go for a Pokeball. Give me much quicker if I just discharge. Oh wait, that doesn't sound right, uh... That's fine, I'm painted. I think we got some level ups out of it, that's good. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm good. Now let's see. Now there is two people on this beach. Why is the camera not moving with me? Three dive balls. Oh, for goodness sake, why do you keep doing this? Okay. So, dodge the Remoray, dodge that guy, you don't need to fight him at all. Another grapple, grapple locked. Don't need to fight that thing either. There's just too many of these things down around here. There needs to be less of them. I would actively promote beaching octopi to get rid of them. There's the pre-evolution of Grappolock. I do not remember its name. Oh wow, I don't remember Pokemon name. Doesn't matter. I'm not that. Um, oh, for goodness sake. Okay. And we got Protector. Just sneak past it. Don't let it catch your attention. And just walk away. And if I remember correctly, you can't actually get over to that beach from here. Anyway, we should be fine. Keep going this one way over to the beach. And we've found a Max Elixir. Which really should be able to be purchased at any store, really. But it, they're not. Scope lens. I mean, I could go that way, but I actually want to go fight some trainers. I will be back.
Okay, those are some trainers to hook down. Now let's shake this tree. Yeah, I think that's enough thievery for one day. I mean, I got some lumberries out of it, that's pretty helpful. Anyway. I've just realised that we do not have a ground type attack on any of our Pokemon, so I need to fix that. Okay, so I taught Dig to Vesuvius instead of... What's it called? I've actually forgotten the name. Rapid Spin. Okay, I guess we're just going to stand outside this desolate landscape for a bit. Why is there a police officer? I can't enter Spike Myth! So I've just been hanging around here this whole time. No one can challenge a dark type leader like this. What's with the gate being shut? How am I gonna get to the g how am I gonna get the gym badge now? What's this police officer doing? Hey, sleepy. Oh, hey, Marnie. Just gonna waddle past all of these guys. I'm not jealous. Anyway. I was born here, so I know I know another way in. If you want to get into town, how about I show you the way? But you're my rival, so I have to beat you. Have to beat me in a battle first. Got it? Yeah, let's go. Oh, for goodness sake, these goons! You've had a pretty good win streak in the gym challenge, just like me. I respect you as my rival. And all that, but I've got I've got too much at stake to go round losing now. Fine, you asked for it. Time to crack my knuckles and go. Starting off with my pod, okay. I haven't healed any of my Pokemon. I should have done something about that. It's fine. I powered up a whole lot. I'm gonna beat you to the ground. Beat you lot into the ground, okay? Sure. Let's see how you go. Uh, you're probably going for a fake out, so I'm going to uh, heal. And did you go for the fake out? Sucker punch. Okay. Uh, now, I'm going to go for the... Let's go Nuzzle. Okay, we're going for a nasty plot. Okay. I'm just gonna. Which one does more damage? Discharge or poison jab? I'm gonna go for discharge because. Oh, I know, you're raising stuff to defense, aren't you? No, wait, no, Nos Plot only does special attack. Finish off with another Nuzzle, why not? Why? You could have faked out- you could have faked me out every single turn. Crafty, uh, this is gonna be risky. Yeah, let's go Spitfire. Yeah, let's go for a home call set up for a first turn. and fly. One hit knockout, not bad. Well, Pekka, I have to switch out for that, definitely. 
Ooh, oh yeah, Vesuvius, let's go, you're perfect for this. Put that Pikachu coin in its place, let's go. Here's a special move that I've been saving just such an occasion. Spark? Yeah, burn it for no reason. Much better than Steam Engine right now, isn't it? Yeah, but your attack power's cut in half, what are you gonna do? I think finish it off with Flame Charge. There aren't an episode in the anime where they go finish it off with False Swipe and like. But how? False Swipe always means you leave it at 1 HP. I was playing Rumble, where, where you only do 1 HP damage. Toxic Croak, I'm gonna switch back to Spitfire. I remember back in the day when I thought Toxic Croak was actually good. As expected of my rival, would you really know how to get me riled up? Oh sure, really. Well, my attack stats gone back down. Yes, I can punch all you like. You missed. Oh, that's bad if he swaggers. Okay, he doesn't swagger, it's fine. Oh, missed that. And oh, it's another one hit KO. Not bad. And we beat Marnie. What's with that? My Pokemon didn't even get a chance to really do their thing at all. It's just RNG, Marnie. You have to be like Wario and manipulate everything. My partner Morapeko has been interested in you and your strength, and I think I get it now. But I've got everyone in Spike Moves supporting me. I'm definitely going to get all eight gym badges just so I can re have a rematch with you. Don't you forget. Don't I'll get my revenge in the Champion Cup. Anyway, I promised I'd show you the way in, so follow me. Are you sure that's why you want to collect eight gym badges? Are you sure it's not just, uh, prove yourself to me? I mean, I can totally see it. Anyway, welcome to the world's strangest corridor, because this is the entire town. It's just one single corridor. Back when I was complaining about the power plant, it could have been something like we had in uh, X and Y. I, which I have to say now, X and Y are my least favourite games. I just don't like them. This kind of has like a feel of Po Town to it, because of course it does. Sure. I still find Po Town quite funny. Anyway, we can't leave. We can't intrude on houses. Ah, oh, we're really trapped in here, aren't we? Anyway, we'll see how this plot plays through in the next episode. See you guys then. Sleep will stop her out.